So if you saw last week's video, uh, Ryan celebrated his birthday over at the island. I'll put a card up there if you haven't seen it, you can go watch it. And then um, uh, today I'm gonna go pick up Ryan and, and take him out fishing. So wish us luck. We're going for Kings. That's a nice tail right there. I got one well feeding right in front of me, another well's feeding uh, off to the stern of us. And there's two of them feeding out here, so the humpbacks have definitely arrived. Hey, so uh, I'm here with Ryan. We're going fishing today, so wish us luck. We're gonna have, uh, we're going for king salmon. Ah, yes. So it was it blew up really windy last night and we thought we were gonna get a little wind today but uh, so far uh, the winds have died down and we, the water's pretty calm so we should have a good day. behind us. You want you've, thang. you've got the arc on that thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's a custom rod but Jeff's dad gave me. Or yeah. I mean, Jeff Jeff's dad gave Jeff and he's let me borrow it. So is that right? That's, That's awesome. custom made rod. Pretty cool. He has yeah. a he has a pair that his dad made him and his dad since you know, passed on so it's pretty pretty nice he let me borrow it. That's awful nice yeah, yeah. What do you think? It's a nice boat. Oh man, it's so nice. <laughs> it just fits smooth. Yeah, very, very fancy. Yeah, that's what that's what having big money gets you. Now, right? I'm just kidding. It's all that YouTube money. It's all that YouTube money. <laughs> all right, we got our first catch of the day. I have no clue what this is though. If anybody out there knows what that is, you let me know. <laughs> so, so far we've got no action out here, but uh, that's gonna change. I got, I got a good feeling about this. Uh, it is a little chilly for being in June. Uh, we're at 48 degrees and once you get your hands wet, oh, it's a little windy. Yeah, it's a little chilly. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> We see fish right Looks on the like bottom. Looks like the fish right there. Looks like I bounced right there. Oh man. How deep is it? Whew, we must be dragging right close to the bottom. I brought you up to 14. Fourteen. So it's nice having Ryan here because this is the maiden voyage with the with using the downringer. So it was a little exciting uh, getting everything all set up. Um, still no no bites. We caught something. That I don't know what that was, but um, that's probably because we drug bottom a little bit. Anyways, uh, yeah, it's uh, just the uh, the um, 
getting it tested out, Ron, I guess. Yeah, it's nice. There's other boats out of here, so we'll see um we'll see if we see any nets in the water. So far we've one guy has caught a king. The only net we need in the water is ours. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That whale's getting closer. Oh, he's coming right at us. Oh, he turned, huh? Oh. Well, there's another one right behind us over here, real close. All right, here, we got a ton of whale activity going on right over here, and so we're trying to catch that. Some of these whales are coming in here and bubble feeding, which they come straight up out of the water with their mouths wide open to eat the herring, so. See if we can catch something for you. Right about the time I turn this camera off, it's gonna happen, right? Uh, where? Oh yeah, there they are right there. That's one of them there. But the other one behind us was way closer. Oh yeah, they're... They're not showing us their tail, so they're not deep diving. So. Oh, shit. I don't know. We're getting this. Well, we, yeah, there's some, there's uh, herring balls all over the place, oh, yeah. so. Oh, there it is. So cool. Yeah, it's incredible. Just don't let him snag my. Don't let him snag my rod. Oh, there he goes. Well, we may not be catching anything, but they are definitely catching fish. Catch me a kick sand, damn it. Yeah, that's all we need. Right? I mean, we caught, pretty sure we caught that. On, oh, I, I caught it for yeah. sure, yeah. So if we, now we catch a fish, it's like, there you go, you got your makings of an epic video. Right? You got a little action, got some cool scenery. We have to find that white boat and be like, hey dude, can we borrow that fish here? <laughs> <laughs> that fish looks like it's already been. <laughs> nice. <laughs> right That's there, right there. Fish. Oh man, oh. look at that. <laughs> You miss Southeast Alaska? Man, oh. <laughs> Look, there's so much beauty down here in Southeast Alaska when it's not raining. When it's not raining. But it rains all the time. <laughs> it's always raining. So, for those that don't know, how many years did you live here? We lived here in Juneau seven years, and we were in Southeast for a total of 10 years. So, he originally, I mean, he retired Coast Guard here out of Juneau. Yep. And uh, then they moved to, to Toke. Well, you moved we to... originally moved to Wasilla because my wife worked for the state. Yeah. And so we moved there for a little while while I was over in Toke Building, just kind of prepping things. And then we just said, let's it's time for a life change. We need to move. So and that's when we moved. Permanently. But he doesn't regret it. Not at all. Oh man. But man, we I love I love, life. I love Southeast Alaska. <laughs> <laughs> There's pluses and minuses to both, right? And it's times like these where you're just trolling oh, yeah. along and whales come up and lunch feed right next to you. Right, or you're seeing, uh, you know, I mean, come on, it's, you just can't beat Southeast for the wildlife. I mean, it's amazing. You got- Eagles everywhere. Eagles, seals, seals sea, sea lions. lions. <clears throat> I flew my drone the other day at, at your place and I got, we saw the footage on the computer. The sea lion sit on the buoy and I was able to fly the drone right there. Yeah. It's just, I mean, that's epic. That's like National Geographic. Yeah. It, it's hard to make an ugly video in this area because the, the surround, the scenery right. is just beautiful. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. There he is. That's He's got to come up again. In. Yeah. So right now we've got a total of three wells fishing in the same area we're fishing in. And so there's there's one out here, and there's this guy, and then there's one in front of us. Now now we need to catch a fish. I think they're more efficient at it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're definitely more efficient at it. 
don't know what to tell you. Maybe we should have went halibut fishing. Yeah, it's all good. <laughs> I mean, it is what it is. Right? Like I said, I haven't seen anybody. They said they've been slaying them, but I haven't seen anybody. Nobody. Although, maybe it's over there. Maybe. Well, that's where they we said to the go. We left the good stuff. Yeah. Maybe we got to go back. Oh, but we'll they also, our way back over there. They also said they've been going like at 3 o'clock in the morning. Why at 3? That's not the tide change, so... 3 in the morning? Yeah. I don't know why they're fishing at 3 in the morning. I don't anymore. know either, but you ain't going to get me fishing at 3 in the morning. No. <laughs> no. Yep. I think I was drooling on myself at 3 in the morning. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, me and Ryan came up empty-handed today. Well, uh, yeah. <laughs> we, we did not catch a fish, but we had a blast. We, we had saw a blast. some whales. Annoyed we, by some kayakers. <laughs> <laughs> no. We so uh, me and Ryan have a lot to. We have a lot in common. We both retired from the service, yep. right? We both love Alaska. There's just a lot to talk about. Yeah, especially since we both lived in this area. You know, talking about different areas to, that I've gone to that maybe he hasn't, or who knows, fishing tips. Talked a lot of fishing techniques. Talked a lot of fishing techniques. So I'm gonna be back. We're gonna we're, we're gonna get this done. We're gonna get a I think get some halibut fishing done or something. One of these days we'll be back. The key is to get outside of the Juno area. Yep. That's the key. Now so, I want Brian to come up there to toke with us and do a moose hunt. So maybe we'll get a moose hunt in one of these days. Did you hear that? <laughs> we'll hold it. We'll hold him to it on that one. We'll hold, hold his feet to the fire on that one. <laughs> no problem. All right, well, thank you guys for watching. Remember, live free. We'll see you next week. Hey, don't forget to subscribe. Click the thumbs up. Oh, his, his uh, channel is uh, Wildwood Off Grid Alaska. Wildwood Off Grid Alaska. Links down below in the description. See ya. All right, well, we didn't have any luck uh, catching any kings, but that's all right. Listen, uh, next week we are headed to Excursion Inlet. We're going to go pick up our, uh, our new skiff. So we should have a good adventure on, on that. So be sure to tune in next week as well.